Yeah, so the, the, the initial problem that we, we try to solve um, when we first kicked off and, and wanted to get our, our foot in the market was a lack of great content. Um, there was some basic cybersecurity awareness training out there. Um, we had experienced it in, in some of the large multinationals very, very early on. Very few companies were offering training to their employees. And those companies that were, it was maybe death by PowerPoint or it was some really awful e-learning you know, attempt at, at educating about you know, basic email security. So we, we identified a huge lack in decent training. Um, and what we realized as well very early on is that the majority of training out there was a, a, a once-off, once-a-year compliance training, tick in the box. You know, no, no companies really were, were offering decent quality training that was engaging and sticky and could really get a message across um, and truly change behavior. Mm-hmm. So, so our first attempt, you know, our first um, sort of product that we took to market was actually a content-only approach. So we, we designed a, a number of modules um, and animation videos Um, that we could then offer to companies um, to then use on their own learning management systems or we partnered with a number of training providers who who could then license our our content out. Um, And we we really had that on the market for about about six months, 12 months, um, until we very quickly realized that a huge demand coming from the market was for the learning platform itself and the ability to deliver that training because a lot of companies didn't have their own learning management systems. They needed Mm. a system to deliver it to their employees. They needed a system to measure uh, training progress and track scores and get behavior and trends back from, from the platform. And uh, another sort of feature that was coming out quite early was the ability to test your employees on what they've learned. And that was done through two key ways. It was done through knowledge assessments or quizzes. Um, And another way to do that was through um, simulated phishing assessments or or simulated phishing attacks where you could actually create a fake phishing email and send that out to your organization and be able to monitor how they react to that and, and, and whether they click on it, whether they open it, whether they follow the links, all this sort of stuff. And the, the system, the phishing simulator can actually measure all of that and let the security manager, let the IT manager know how vulnerable his organization is to phishing. So we identified quite early on that that was a a demand coming from a lot of our customers, a lot of our partners coming from the industry. And we we then pivoted away from being a a content-only solution into delivering the the full spectrum of it. 